The oceans are constantly changing. Waves, tides and currents modify the coast and the seabed. Sediment moves and settles. Wrecks drift. Human activities are also having an impact. Construction and coastal development. Offshore activities like oil and gas exploration. Renewable energy projects such as wind farms, aquaculture. They are all changing the topography. Mapping the ocean is a never-ending task. Sea surveys and the search for wrecks can be costly, time-consuming and laborious. It is estimated that only 18% of the seabed has been mapped so far. Full hydrographic surveys to obtain up-to-date coverage and accuracy can be dangerous and dirty in certain areas. Autonomous vehicles, whether underwater, on the surface or airborne, can now do the job far more effectively than manned aircraft, boats or divers. Autonomous underwater vehicles can detect pipelines, unexploded ordnance, or even lost containers. Swarms of autonomous survey vessels rapidly gather wide swaths of accurate multi-beam data, which can even be pre-processed before returning to the mother vessel. Aerial drones can carry optical sensors to map the shape of the shore, intertidal areas, and shallow waters. Autonomous technologies are helping to make great advances in hydrography. But hydrography is also supporting progress in autonomous transportation technologies. Up-to-date and comprehensive hydrographic information is essential to develop autonomous shipping that is safe, efficient and sustainable. In 1921, the International Hydrographic Organization first started to establish technical standards for the creation of sea maps to allow for safe navigation and the protection of the marine environment. This work continues to this day for the entire scope of digital hydrographic data.